Hi guys, my name is Aisha Amin and welcome to Style Sesh. Today, I will be doing five different looks uh, on how to style a satin skirt. If you're into modest fashion or just fashion in general, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I will be posting every week, inshallah. Um, if you've been following me from before, um, my personal style, I would describe more to bold, but sometimes I like to be... I like to dress differently depending on mood so it's not necessarily just one style that I stick to so I could be feeling like really feminine and be like okay I'm gonna wear something really feminine but still bold or I could be like totally rebellious but still bold your undergarments are really important and it makes such a difference because you don't want to be wearing an undergarment that is too tight and you know have all these bulges out or you don't want something that's too loose because you want everything to be in <laughs> everything to be in place when you wear the right undergarment it puts everything into place so your outfit will look more uh, how to say terletak uh, so you won't look frumpy or slicky or whatever that's that's why your undergarment is really important Alright, so back to the look of the day. The first look is a super casual laid-back look. This is something I would wear to the grocery store, go fetch my kids, or run errands. I paired the satin skirt with a denim jacket because the different textures give a great contrast. I then completed the look with a blush hijab and handbag to give a more feminine touch. The key to an effortless look is to have something in your outfit that is chill. So in this outfit, it would be the sneakers. Sneakers are comfortable, practical and gives a stylish addition to your outfit. For the second look, I created a neutral work appropriate outfit. So I paired the satin skirt with a light peach blouse. I kept everything else neutral with a nude hijab and bag. For comfort, I added these white flat slip-ons. Oh, and of course I'm wearing socks. This outfit is all about comfort for a full day at the office. You can also add some jewelry if you like. I have a warm skin undertone so gold or light gold accessories suit me best. If you have a cool skin undertone, then silver or stained jewelry might suit you best. For look number 3, I felt a little rebellious so I went for a dark punk inspired outfit. I really love this look because pairing feminine and masculine elements in an outfit is always aesthetically pleasing. This is because it creates a contrast or also an element of surprise. I paired the satin skirt with a blue shirt and wore a graphic tee on top and completed the look with black shoes, hat and hijab to match. This is something I will probably wear to a festival, concert, or art exhibition. As a hijabi, I love experimenting with fashion, and trying out new styles is exciting. Fashion is such a great tool to express your inner energy. For the fourth look, I went for a monochromatic outfit. To me, the key to nailing a monochromatic look is to pair the right textures, the right silhouettes and have a great balance of proportion. For instance, when we talk about silhouette, if you're wearing something fitted on top, then you can opt for something looser at the bottom to balance it out, and vice versa. It's always best to wear something that is not form-fitting because when you wear something that is looser, it creates a column effect so you look taller and slimmer. This is an outfit that I will wear out with my friends, have coffee, and just chill.
for the last look, this is a combination of the two things I love most, color and blazers. So I paired the satin skirt with a bright beautiful fuchsia color and I completed the whole look with brown and gold essence. This is an outfit I most probably would wear to a social event or party or even date night. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, feel free to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys later. Bye!